Hey, what's going on, broskies? This is Total Boss here, running you all kinds of Minecraft crap. Today we got a 1.5 update video. Yes, this is a very anticipated update and is right up my alley because of the redstone update. So, let's get underway, but the sun is rising to represent a new era of Minecraft redstone. Nah, that was just called good timing. But, uh, okay. So, let's get underway. I'll start with the minor stuff that have nothing to do with the redstone, then I'll get to the new items. Okay? So, first, sadly, uh, it takes two bow meal, but there's the cool particle effect. Uh, two bow meal on fertilized grass, and, you know, stuff like that. New texture for lava. If you really notice that much, it's a bit different than the old one. Now, the new slash effect command. Now, on those, there's a slash scoreboard command, but I have no idea how to work that at all. So, it confuses me. <laughs> so, you know. Slash effect, I did nearest player, and then one is speed, and that's a million seconds. And then the amplifier is four. Now, a million and four are the maxes. I just wanted to show you. The amplifier four actually means level five. Yeah, the amplifier four means level five, but uh, it's because like one amplifier equals like level two. It's really confusing. The amplifier is optional, but it it makes everything better. And on the other side, I did one with jump boost. So <laughs> when I hit this lever, I will be like Superman, and that's why I have milk in my inventory, so I can. Okay, watch this. My screen will drop out back like crazy. Look at that. Okay, now that I'm Superman, watch this. Whoa! <laughs> this is unfair. How high can I jump? I wonder how good a parkour I am. I want to see if I can get on top of the nether portal. Oh, I can! Okay, I'm flying now. Okay, I won't fly. No, this is walking. Okay, let me put this into third person. Look at that. Okay, so... I'm just, like, strolling. Oh, look at that jump! Okay. Okay. I think we've had enough. Total Boss has had his fun. Everybody's like, we get it! It's fun! So, I shall turn that off. Drink my milk. I feel like I got slowness because the, it went so much forward, I got used to it a bit. And it's kind of freaky. But now dispensers have new, amazing uh, builders. This is amazing. I swear. So, I get up here. I got no armor on right now. As you see clearly, one diamond chest plate is in there. No, I want to hit the lever. And, as you see, a diamond chest plate has been dispensed. Onto my chest <laughs> of manliness. My manly chest. Yes. And uh, if you put a flint and steel in there, bam, look at that. Fire. Great for weapon straps and such, guys. Huh? Huh? You know, you like it. So, next one is so if I got a seed here, hit the lever, bone meal in there. Uh, okay. Pretty sure it's supposed to work. Okay. Okay. It's a bit glitchy, the update. I did that. I felt like it. Okay, that's supposed to work. Whatevs. So. Oh, I had a seed in there. Who cares? Okay, whatever. Uh, so, uh. As you see, there is a weird nameplate, you think. Maybe this guy is using MC Edit. No, I'm not. I'm in vanilla Minecraft right now. And I got a villager. <laughs> so this is done. Okay, I'll show you how to do this. So his name is Bab. <laughs> if, if you... What? Did it, okay, it didn't go away. So now... Uh, <laughs> so you see, you just take away on the anvil. It's a villager spawner. 
So I just change it to uh that weirdo. How about that? That weirdo. So now it, its name is changed to that weirdo. Okay. So now I spawn him. And he's got a name plate. He's that weirdo. I'm gonna spawn a bunch of them. <laughs> it's that weirdos. No, nah, no. Nah. You guys are all weird. Ah, it's a mini that weirdo. Okay, I'm freaked out. Okay. Next up. We got these nether racks here. And uh, we can now smelt them and make something magical. But while they smelt, I will show you the nether quartz blocks. A new item added to 1.5. Used for redstone, but also look at these amazing decorative pillars and stuff. That's beautiful. And there's even stairs and half slabs, so there's like everything. And look, nether bricks. Is that amazing or what? <laughs> so, you, you, I need four nether bricks to show you how to do it. Yeah, one more. <laughs> so, like, take these. Mix another brick block. So, you know, that's cool. Get away, you weirdo. You are a weirdo. Get away from Bob. No. No. Okay. Okay. I think you get it now. And here's another cool feature. So, let's just say I got all this nether rack. Okay. Okay. So, if I'm crafting and I hold the right click button, look what happens. It just goes around. So it goes everywhere. I'm like, I'm holding right click right now. And, oh no! I just lost all that netherrack. So, now if I, right, if I double click on this stack. I, why is everything so glitchy? Okay, there it worked. So if I double click on it, it, it will make it into that pile there. I don't know why this update is a bit glitchy with the stuff. So now let's get into real redstone junk territory. Wow. Okay. So first off we got the compare the comparator. The comparator. Okay, the redstone comparator. You toggle it like that. I have not found out what it does. It's actually on right now because there's stuff in this container. And when there's stuff in the container it toggles on. And that's how it looks. Now, I'll show you what it does over there. But, you do three stone, redstone, torch, redstone, torch, sort of pointing up, and then the nether quartz in the middle. So, that's kind of cool. And, uh, here, so, right now, that piston is powered, right? From the com- the com- the temperature temperature, whatever. What What's it called? The- Oh, I gotta say this. The comparator. The comparator. That's what it is. But, if there's a stronger signal from the side, it does not put out any output. Now, I haven't found out what this does. I'm gonna try to do... No. I have no idea what it does. Whatever. Okay. Moving on. And you made... Th and this have half a tick of delay. Just to prove that. Just a little bit of delay there. As you see. Moving on. We got the block made of pure redstone. The redstone block. Now, this amazing contraption. Uh, it, it emits a constant power source. So if I, and it's movable too. Which is cool. So if I put it near that light, it'll light. You weirdo! Why did I spawn so many of you? So... Axe is a constant power source. My favorite funny thing is you can place redstone torches on them, but they will always stay off no matter what. Oh man, that's super lag. Okay. Next up, we got the hopper. Now this is, this is hoppy. This is hopping, bro. So we got a bunch of these blocks of redstone, and when it's on, it, uh, when it's being powered, it does not do what it's supposed to do, but when it's not powered, 
it's taking it out and, and it can uh sorry there my bench first but it can transfer items uh, into other stuff like other chests so now i have a rail over here and what I don't know what that was. I did not press shift, I swear. So now if you if you go over to that little edge, they can be placed over hoppers for nice and easy loading stations. So, next off, we have the redstone dropper. So it has this cobblestone ring of amazingness. Oh, and I forgot to mention, these guys here can be placed, uh, these dispensers, they carry a different texture when they placed up. Just again. Now I and they also carry the same texture when placed down. Which is again cool. And I just wanted to note that because of the dropper over here does the same thing. Now as an example I put an arrow in there and a dispenser would shoot that out, but the dropper has dropped that item out. And it doesn't have any of the new properties that it has. But it is basically the most, it's just ridiculously easy. Seven cobblestone and one redstone is just so easy to obtain in survival mode. Now with this 58 netherrack I got here, this will come in handy for my weighted pressure plate. Now, you make it out of gold for the light one and out of iron for the heavy one. You can't really see that it says heavy, but it'll say heavy there. So, either way, I will show you what it does. Okay. So in the light one, it, it see if I step on it, it won't output at all, no matter what. On the light one though, okay. One, it'll already output when you put one on either one. But let's see it depends it varies on how long it takes to get to two. Oh, that did not take me long at all to get to two blocks. Now that was like four blocks. Now with the heavy one I gotta like spam like crazy. To get that second block there to power. Just looking at that second block. Oh, there it is. So it took me a while. As you see, the heavy one is different. Over here we have the trap chest. And as you see, it off put outputs a power. And actually use the trap chest area just to make this. And as you see, there's a bit of a red tint, like blood. It's freaky. Eh. Blood chest! Either way, open it up, it's just a normal twist and a tripwire to make a trap twist. And they look the same in your inventory. Just a different name. And uh, as you notice here, the trap chest and the normal chest can stay together. And redstone will come out of the trap chest. So, survival players, multiplayer server, whatever you want to call it, that's what will happen. So, now we got the TNT minecart. Oh, I'm scared. Which is just a minecart with TNT on top of it over here, the activator rail, which activates the TNT. Six iron like this, two sticks, and one redstone torch will give you six activator rails. Now, haha, <laughs> this is where I showed off. Ah. Yeah. Okay, well, it will not destroy rails, which is again cool, but it will destroy redstoning. So, uh, yeah. Let's move on. I got limited time for this video. Anyway. So now, we got the uh, daylight detector. Oak wood slab, oak wood slab, oak wood slab. Well, it doesn't matter what kind of wood slab. And the nether quartz, three of them, and then the glass. So, that's cool, right? You just go over here, it's not outputting anything, but if I go time set zero, it will output power if you put it on an inverter, then it will make lights that light up only at night. Again. And I will be doing redstone designs with these stuff. So, for my final act, I'm going to go into the nether. May take a bit here. So. Now, walk out of the thing. Just to show you what nether quartz ore looks like. And it's pretty common. Can be mined with any pickaxe. So, and it will help with your redstone adventures. Wow. That's pretty. So, you know, I'm going to close this off with a classic, you know, turtle boss thing. 
This is Total Boss here saying to all you Redstone fans and Update fans and Minecraft fans, for that matter, ciao. Attack on the Enderman! Oh my god! Oh my god!